Hey everybody! Welcome back to my channel. My name is Savannah if you are new here and today we are doing Legacy Challenge. I hope you guys had a really good weekend. I know I did. I had more family come and stay with me for the weekend. My grandparents came and we didn't really do much except for eat and relax. <laughs> we also played Game of Thrones Monopoly which I have had for a while but I still haven't played it so we finally played it. It's so much fun, I love it. I won, I bankrupted everybody, which is crazy because I've never won a Monopoly, but the past two times that I have played, I have won, I bankrupt everyone, it's pretty crazy. So yeah, thank you guys so much for 13,000 subscribers. I still can't believe it. All I know is that I'm really, really thankful for you guys and I love you. And I'm just super excited to see where this channel is gonna go. Since my last video, a lot of you guys have reached out to me on Instagram. You guys send me like such sweet messages, and I'm just like, wow, you, ser you guys are seriously so sweet. Like, I can't say it enough. But yeah, thanks to everyone who reached out. Love you so much. Enough rambling, let's get into this episode of Legacy Challenge. Okay, guys, here we are back in the household. What the heck? What's going on here? Hang on. I need to document this. <laughs> oh! Oh. Okay. <clears throat> there is a lot that happened. Let me just <clears throat> let me just start at the beginning. So everyone is very sad. <laughs> I'm so annoyed. Actually, okay, hang on. Wait, hold on. <laughs> Sorry, I'm so all over the place. I'm just so excited to film this episode. Okay. So basically, I gave people makeovers. I grew out Olive's hair because she was pregnant and it's been a while. So I figured her hair would grow. I gave Zara a made makeover. I made her look more her age. Um, I toned down her style a little bit. Um, and I also gave her parents a makeover, which is actually really annoying because I spent a lot of time making them over. And then I jumped into this game and they both died from being old. So that's annoying because I was excited to show you guys what they looked like. I gave them both gray hairs. I took off their nasty randomized outfits and gave them some actual outfits, but it doesn't even matter anymore. Um, another, th so everyone's like super sad. Everyone has tears in their eyes because they lost a grandparent or a parent or a friend or whatever. So yeah, that's what's happening here. Um, another thing. <laughs> When I opened the game, I was like, what the heck is all this? First time. First woohoo. And I was like, what the heck? I looked in the noties. What would it be like? Woohoo with a ghost. Okay, and I was like, wait. <laughs> what ghost? And then I see Mr. Freaking Silas over here being all pink and flirty and I was like hold the freaking phone Ren's first time was with Silas dead Silas her first time is with a ghost I'm a little bit pissed off right now because I kind of wanted to decide who Ren was going to have her first time with but at the same time, I'm just like, that is so funny. That is totally like something that would happen in this game. Ren deciding who she wants to woohoo with for the first time. And of course it's a ghost. And of course it's Silas because her and Silas have always kind of had a thing. I don't know if you guys remember, but he was like one of the options for her love interest. So... I don't know. I think that's pretty funny. So yeah, her and Silas now are have some um, romance bar. Their romantic interests. They did. They were warming themselves by the fire together that one time. I don't know. There's always been like a little bit something there. So yeah, that happened, and I'm a little bit sad that we missed it. When I opened my game, like it had just happened. So I was like, right on. <laughs> What else happened? Oh, I moved Oliver out. A lot of you guys were telling me in the comments that you wanted to see his apartment. So I think we're just going to grab Olive. What is she doing? Reacting positively to Sim's presence? 
That is so weird. They're just like jumping up and down and they're happy because they're around someone they like. Okay. All right. Well, I'm going to go ahead and travel with Olive. We're going to go and visit Oliver at his new apartment. I moved them into the penthouse apartment. Okay, so this is a little overview of their penthouse apartment. I also got them a dog. He is a... Oh my gosh, he's not a husky. I think he's an Akita. His name is Fish. I thought that was really cute since Oliver is a food critic and he loves food. Um, I thought it would be cute to name him something after food. <laughs> so yeah, I'll give you guys a little tour. Um, so you come in through these double doors. Here's their living space. It's super industrial and just very manly, but also, I don't know how to explain it. Very warm tones. I just really love it. I think it's so cozy. So this is our living area. Then you come over here, there's this dining space, a uh, little keyboard, some movie posters, some family photos over here on the fireplace that's lit. It's just so cozy in here. Here's the kitchen and, oh, here's the doorway area. Lots of books. Um, this is this computer area. I love this skeleton. I think he's so cool as a decor piece. Um, so yeah, here's the kitchen. Um, very, very nice kitchen because we all know Oliver loves to cook. He loves food. He's a freaking food critic. <laughs> so yeah. Ooh, isn't that nice? With the snow in the back. Big mood. He got this plaque from work. I don't really know what the plaque was, but I just put it on the wall. This is their bathroom. Very nice. Lots of different textures and colors. Um, yeah, big fan of this bathroom. What you got there? A grilled cheese, really? Okay, that's fine, I guess. <laughs> I didn't change anything outside. Hey, what happened? Did Olive decide to go home without me telling her to go home? I've never had a Sim do that before. Oh, she went to school. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Make sure to study hard. <laughs> uh, anyway, you guys get the gist of their apartment. We'll go back another day. But yeah, that is Oliver's new house. I hope you guys like it. So Max is just... What are you doing? Eat cake? No, no, no. Practice your speech. <laughs> you're almost there to maxing it. Like, almost. And then you're cooking. We will work on next. Zara... I know you're so sad. Why don't you call call sadness hotline? Wait, what the heck was this? Split from household and move? Interesting. Very interesting. Ran has almost maxed her cooking skill, her fitness skill, her pipe organ skill. I'm going to get her to do her pipe organ thing. Actually, <laughs> Come here and super sell all of this stuff, please. And I think you have a lot of poop in your inventory that we can use to harvest some of these plants over here that are worth a lot. I think that these like orchid plants are, and the tulip plants, I think they're worth a lot. So I'm gonna get her to just, let's see. Can you please come here and super sell? And then fertilize with large pet poop. And we have um, rainbow poop as well. This this will prove to be excellent fertilizer for gardening. So yeah, definitely gonna use that. Okay, and I just got a notification that tomorrow is Winterfest. So let's go ahead and get the Christmas decorations out. All right, there we go. So let's check the calendar. Let's see what's going on today. Oh, it's Oliver's birthday and it's the baby's birthday. Okay, so we do need a cake today. Wow. Time flew by, didn't it? Is there... Let's see what's going on here. Oliver wants to go to GeekCon. Nah. Ooh, there is a cake in here. Yay. Oh my gosh. There's so much food. Stop. Um, come change this dirty diaper. Black and bass? Uh, sure, let's just bust out all the leftover food so that we can have some for these birthdays. 
All right, let's add an event for today. We're going to be having a birthday party. Birthday Sim, Olive. Let's see, who should we invite? Oliver, April, Max Jr., Riley, Philippe, Alexander, Janine. Oh no. Okay, there we go. Tegan, oof. Should we invite Rowan? Let's invite her and then let's get Ren to convince Alex to break up with her during the party. <gasps> mm, so spicy, gotta love it. One mixologist, yes. Do we want an entertainer? I think we'll be fine without it. Oh no, Max has work. You know what, Max? It's your daughter's birthday. Please take a vacation day. Uh, let's see here. Take vacation day. Zara, do you have work? Three days, you're good. Did you max that skill yet, love? Almost there. And Patchy's just here listening. That's so cute. So now that Ren woohooed with Ghost Silas, I don't know, should we get her with Alex still? Okay, I'm pretty sure I told you to take a vacation day. Why are you at work still? Yay! Ren maxed her pipe organ skill, finally! Ren can now play avant-garde songs and write new songs on the pipe organ. Bomb! All right, Max, you're gonna have to come home. <sighs> Olive's just getting her fun up. She's also very tired, no. Okay, go to sleep for a little bit. Go to sleep for a little bit. So that you can be nice and rejuvenated for when everyone shows up. All right, love, how's your energy? It's pretty good. So let's go ahead and let's do plan outfit. Zara's, now's not the time to go on. Actually, I really like what you're wearing. No, I was too late. <laughs> mm. Yeah, I like what you're wearing. We can keep it at that. All right, Olive, so you need to socialize with the birthday sim for three hours. Have sims dance at the same time. Make drinks. Okay, Max, please don't eat that. You're gonna get sick. <laughs> Stop! It's freaking spoiled, my dude. Okay, play a game with the birthday sim. Mm, does that count? Do video games count? Let's see. Play game. Play party frenzy together. I really want to get a gold on this party. Okay, that worked. Have Sims dance at the same time? They were all dancing just now. Lame. Okay, come and make a wish before the time runs out. It's your birthday. Go, Olive. It's your birthday. Go, Olive. It's your birthday. Gonna blow out these candies. Get it, girl. Happy birthday! Whoa! What the heck? What the... Oh my god, I'm missing it! My mouse is freaking out! <laughs> oh, okay. Alright, we have to figure out what her last trait's gonna be. I think this is the trait that's gonna be uh, unique. So let's see. Her dad is a foodie. He is a kleptomaniac. And oh my gosh, I always forget his last trait. What is it? Neat. Zara, cheerful. Cat lover. Geek. Okay. Oh god. Paranoid? Paranoid. Oh my god. Paranoid. What? I mean, sure. <laughs> oh, that's that's so weird. Okay. I'm trying to think of how that would fit into the story. All right. So Olive is a geek. She's cheerful and she's paranoid and her aspiration is successful lineage. Okay, happy birthday, babe. Proud of you. I'm gonna get her to make drinks so that this little thingy can get checked off. I don't understand. Everyone was dancing together at one point and it didn't like register. Oh, gold, 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 yay. Okay, Ren, you can stop that. Uh, let's get her to... Other Sims. 
<sighs> Where's the trash talk one? I thought that. Oh, I think it's under mean. Other Sims break up with Rowan. Right in front of her? Oh my god, is that really something that you would do? We'll see what happens. So. Move, Tay! You're right, I can do so much better than her. Oh my! She's like, okay, I'm off. <laughs> oh my god, that was really sad. What are they doing? Oh, okay. She's just not the one for you, you know? <laughs> I don't know how else to say it. Oh my gosh, you don't have any plasma packs. You silly girl, come and order some. Looks like Olive's just having a shower. I think we can probably- Ooh, we need to age up the baby. That's right, it's the baby's uh, birthday as well. And look who is upsetting the child. Can you not put him down? You are not around before you're trying to be around now. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Excuse me. Excuse me, sir. All right, Charlie, let's see what you're going to be like. Angelic, easygoing toddlers. They are never defiant and don't throw a tantrum. They can easily talk to strangers. Aww. <laughs> All right. Let's see what you look like. Look at her eyeliner. Isn't she just, like, super cool? I love her. Okay, so... You've got orange eyes, which I really like, because Olive has yellow eyes, and uh, orange has brown eyes, so if you mix them together, it kind of turns into this color. He's cute. It's kind of hard to tell right now, but you're definitely not going to have orange hair. Like, that just doesn't make any sense whatsoever. So let's find you some good hair, shall we? Should we give him this hair? <laughs> Absolutely not. I need to get some new hairs for my toddler boys because they all look the same. How about this one? It's really annoying that there's not like a good brown color. I'm just gonna go with this one. This is actually Max Jr's hair, but I haven't used it on a toddler yet. It's really cute, I like it a lot. Okay, I gave him Olive's eyebrows and Olive's skin details. And now he really looks like Olive. So I imagine Olive's baby to be extremely stylish <sighs> because she's very stylish so I think that she would choose to dress him how she wants. So let's see what we got, shall we? I really need more toddler stuff. <laughs> I love this little jacket. I think this is like super duper stylish. So is this. So adorable. All right, here's his first outfit. I love the little shoes. And here is his like face and hair all done. You guys, he's super, super, super cute. He looks a lot like Olive. Like if we put Olive's hair on him, it looks a lot like her. <laughs> All right, let's give you one more little outfit here. I really liked this coat in that color. And then for the shoes for this outfit, you can just have little boots, I guess. All right, guys, we are back. We need to make Oliver a room somehow in this house. I kind of want to wait until like we redo the house to be, you know how we're redoing the house for every heir? Well, I do want to redo the house when Olive becomes heir, so it's like... Oh! We have this room! Okay, that'll work just fine. I forgot we moved Oliver out. So let's see here. This is just going to be very temporary. We just need a little bed for him. Uh, Cha-cha-cha. This is very temporary. Oh, and we need a potty to potty train him as well. 
Boom. Okay. All good. All good. All good. All good. So he's feeling very energized. Oh, we need um one of these. One of these bad boys. Which one should we get him? Let's just get the regular teddy bear and put it next to the tree. There is a yeah, right here. Boom. Okay, it's very Christmassy, I think. All right, come over here and babble your little heart out so you can get your communication up. All right, and you're feeling sad from your grandparents. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. Call sadness hotline. All right, Max, I need you to come and get your cooking skill up some more. Why don't you make, let's see, what's something that we haven't made? We haven't made a crown roast. Go ahead and do that. He's feeling confident, so it should come out pretty good. All right, and what else do we need to be doing? Zari, you need to be working on your video gaming skill. Uh, ooh, your vampire lore is pretty up there. Hmm. Live stream? Oh, that's so sick. Live stream Destiny's effect. That's rad. I didn't even know you could do that. What's she doing? Are you really shoveling snow in your heels? Can you not do that? <laughs> Come over here. We need to get you a job as well. And what do you want to do for this? Read to a child for two total hours. Social. Social. Can't speak. Socialize with your child 10 times. Okay, yeah, you can definitely do that, but you're so tired and so hungry, so come and grab a serving and then sleep. I think we can end the party now, actually. So stoked we got a gold. A new dresser? Wow. It was a hint to start dressing your new age. Wow, okay. What the heck's all this money coming from? Oh, I think she's getting money from her live stream. That's rad. That is so cool. Have you guys ever noticed this? I was actually accidentally hovering over the bed and it said assign to left side olive. So you can assign sides of the bed. That's hilarious. Can you not? Olive, I'm going to need you to come and discipline this child for making a mess. Calmly ask not to make a mess, clean it up, and then he's really tired, so why don't you read him to sleep? She's such a cute mom. I love her so much. Aw, what's wrong, Bean? Ren! <laughs> She's always got to be around. Cute! Love. Love them, love them, love them. <sighs> Zara has gained zero followers from that live stream. Uh, okay. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. What was that? 4,000? Okay. That's better. I was like, wow, zero followers for streaming that long? Max, come and watch the cooking channel so you can get those... Skilly's up. Um, it looks like the pasta primavera went off. Who made this? Oh, just Mender. Our caterer. Okay. All right. Olive needs a job. So I have always had this thought in my mind of her being in the stylist career. Uh, style influencer. Right. Yes. Okay. There we go. She now has a job. She wants to read to a child for two hours and socialize with a child ten times. Reach level two writing skill and write an article. Okay. You've got mail. Oh my gosh. We've got mail. Oh my gosh. Check for Winterfest gifts? Is that new? I guess I've never gotten the mail. Um uh on winterfest before i can't speak <laughs> all right so olive is feeling inspired she's just practicing her writing zara you're like super focused that means you need to play force self to play game what i've never seen that before uh okay let's get her to enter a professional tournament let's do destiny effect because she plays that all the time 
Max, what are you doing? You're having a bath? Cute, cute, cute. Moose needs a bath really badly. <laughs> That's normally a job for Olive, but I'm gonna get... I'm gonna get Ren to do it. Olive can now self-publish books. That's lovely. So what does she need to do? Write an article. Okay, you could stop practicing. So why don't you write, let's see. Where is that option? Change passwords. <laughs> That's so funny. Yes, change passwords. Do it because you're, uh... ooh, here, here it is. Everyone but households. Lock computer for everyone but households. Finally. Oh my gosh, I've been looking for that forever. Okay, career, let's do write article. What else can she do for her? Fashion blog. Ah, Glabe. Cute. Ooh, Zara won. Good for you, girl. Okay, just keep playing. Keep playing, keep practicing. Max, you need to work on your cooking skill. How do we do this? Just, I guess just keep cooking. I don't know how else. It is Christmas, so I do want them to uh, decorate the tree together. Let's sell this, we don't need it anymore. Let's turn this on to holiday, holiday, holiday. Did I pass it? winter holiday there we go oh and i also want you to cook a grand meal of course let's do tofurkey why not switch it up a little bit look he's almost got it up there almost there you just need to keep cooking oh ren's setting the table how sweet i'm gonna need you to add a present as well add present olive you're up why don't you add a present as well yes he did it Max did it! Okay, okay, okay. Max learned the recipes for roast chicken and tuna casserole. Okay, that's great. That is just great. Let's go ahead and invite over the important people. Oliver, Max Jr., April, Alex. That's it, I think. I'm gonna get Olive here to decorate the tree with Oliver. They're doing ornaments, I think. I told her to do it with Oliver, but he's just not here. <laughs> Max, why don't you come say hello to your boy? When does he age up, I wonder? Just get to know him a little bit. Cuties, I love them. Oh, there they go. They're doing the tree. Wait a minute. Didn't was that Max? Oh my god, yes! Okay, he maxed charisma and he maxed cooking and he maxed dancing. Nothing else is like super close. That's good enough. Three skills. I'm so proud of him. Maladay, 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 Malady Cute. Alright, come over here and call the grand meal. Wait, don't go! Is he leaving? Oh my god, I can't believe we missed Father Winter. No! The heck is going on here? Oh. Okay, come on. Call the grand meal. Ah, there he is. He's back, he's back, he's back. Polite introduction. Ooh, Moose aged up. Moose aged up. Oh my gosh, she's now an elder. Dog lives are so short. It's crazy. Alright, Max is asking Father Winter for a present. Let's see what he gets. Okay, well, cool. Um, I was trying to get them to get a present from him, but nothing was working. So let's uh, let's all open presents then. 
All right, what do we get? Ooh, a digital camera. That's pretty good. A whiskers of a forgotten past. Okay. Uh, 2,000 ounces of gold under the sea. Nice. Oh my gosh, look at Moose, you guys. He's so gray. Aww. Merry Christmas. What'd you get? Schmapple Micro. No clue what that is. Come on, Bean. Come open a present. What'd you get? Teresa the Triceratops. <laughs> so cute. Did everyone open a present? Ooh, Ren. Oh, come give Alex a Christmas rose as a Winterfest gift. That is so romantic. Come on, girl, do it. Come on. Oh no, did Alex leave? Dang it, that would have been so cute! <gasps> oh! My god! You guys! No! <laughs> What? This just no. Why, you guys? Why? Why would you do that? I don't understand. You guys, no. <laughs> you better calm down, or you're gonna die. Dude, oh my god, I'm so pissed off right now. What the heck? Alex, no! Good thing Ren didn't see that. No wonder you couldn't give him the rose. He was woohooing with Zara. I don't like you anymore. You're messed up. Zara is literally Ren's best friend. Like, they're best friends now. And he went and did that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is just ridiculous. Well, Ren did woohoo with Silas, so... I don't know. Alright, why don't we give... Let's go to... Huh. What should we do? Let's go on a walk. Let's go for a jog. Why not? We've literally never taken Moose on a jog before. Or a walk. We have such a big lot, so I guess it doesn't really matter. But we should definitely do it. Anyway. Go, go, go. Have fun. I know it's freezing, but... How are you doing, Bean? You need some fun and you're starving, but you've been sleeping this whole time. Uh, all right, let's see. I'm gonna sell this. Sell, sell, sell. <gasps> Ouch. <gasps> what the? <laughs> you guys, you guys, you guys, you guys. Oh my God. I was just here minding my own business and then I got this notification. I swear I didn't do this. I did not do this. This is the freaking risky woohoo, the freaking uh, the slice of life. Oh my god, is it Alex's? Whose is it? It's got to be Alex's. Holy crap! Oh my god, what the heck? Talk about revenge! Having a kid with Max's best friend? Oh my goodness gracious. Wow! Zara, you sneaky little bean. <laughs> What's wrong with you? That is so messed up. That is so messed up that even my mind didn't think of that. Okay, well... 
Ren is definitely not gonna get with Alex now. That is just ridiculous. I guess maybe Silas? I don't know, I've never had a, um, a, a ghost relationship before. I mean, it definitely makes the story more realistic when you've got Risky Woohoo on and all that junk. So, yeah, I don't know. I cannot believe this is happening, you guys. I can't believe Zara is having a baby with Alex. That is not how I predicted this to go. Like, not even a little bit. I don't think Dirk's gonna want to be with Zara now. When she's pregnant with some other dude's baby? If I was him, I wouldn't. I would not want her to move into my house. Just think about it. Like, okay, we're together. We're about to move in with each other. You just had to get your family issues in order. You slept with someone else and now you're having a kid with them? Yeah, no. I don't want to be with you anymore. So I would assume that... That is definitely off the table now. Ugh, you stupid, stupid girl. Now what? <laughs> so I don't know. Should we... Should we have Ren confront Zara and be like, Yo, what the heck? You knew I liked Alex. So why did you sleep with him? And why are you having a kid with him now? Or... Should we say that Ren gave her permission since she slept with Silas? Or woohooed with Silas? Ren doesn't seem like the type that would be like bitter about it. You know what I mean? I think she would be. I don't know. She doesn't really have time for that. <laughs> Um, I think I'm gonna go ahead and invite Lilith over. I've been meaning to do this for like the longest time. Uh, let's see. Invite to hang out at Current Lot. I want them to hang out and maybe do some like vampire stuff together so that she can get her vampire uh, level higher. And I know that a good way to do that is to like spar and stuff with other vampires. Okay, here she is. Okay, uh, request training. All right, I'm gonna get them to spar now. She has like no energy, but I really want to see this. You probably shouldn't go out. Oh, shoot. Wow, look at that. Ren is just standing there. Oh! Okay. Wow. 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 She got her ass kicked. You guys, I am still shook that Zara is pregnant. I can't stop thinking about it. Ew, look who's here. Orange. Should we invite him in? Oh, you guys, I just got a notification that it's almost Max's birthday. Ooh, so he's gonna be an elder. Some of you guys were saying that you think it would be best if he died on the lot. And I kind of agree. It seems like every heir lives their life. Um, lives their, li their, their entire life on the lot. Which I think makes sense. So we can have his grave plot and everything on the lot as well. So that's good. Look at this. Family times. Oh, and they're not getting along. And of course, he's taking a freaking selfie. I think he's still a teenager, actually, so I don't know. All right, Olive has completed the caregiver portion of her successful lineage thingy. So that's good. I'm gonna get her to give him a bath really quick because he's very smelly. Oh my gosh. Zara is depressed. Max! Get out! Stop watching her bathe with your cocktail. Oh my gosh, it's 7 in the morning and he has a cocktail. This family. And she's like depressed, crying in the bath because she's pregnant. You did this to yourself, dude. I don't know what to tell you. Why don't you come and live stream? Maybe that will make you feel better. <laughs> 
Okay, guys, I'm gonna leave this part right here. I've been uh, recording for quite some time. A lot happened, a lot happened that I didn't think would happen. Like my Sims are starting to decide their lives for themselves and wow. Talk about a roller coaster. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Please let me know in the comments what you think of everyone's relationships and everything that happened in this episode. Let me know and I'll see you in my next video. I love you. Bye!